All right, really quick before we start the video, I just wanna say thank you to all my subscribers. The channel just actually passed 1,000 subscribers, so I just wanna say thank you to everybody. And yeah, so let's get started with the video. All right, what's up you guys? In this video, we're gonna talk about how much cardio should you do in a week when you're trying to lose weight or trying to lose fat, whatever it is, how much cardio should you do? And so for me and for most people, what seems to work is three low intensity steady state cardio sessions per week and one high intensity interval training session per week that usually works for most people especially while cutting and in this video i want to talk about why and so when you're cutting you guys you have to be in a calorie deficit and if you don't know about calorie deficit and macros and tracking macros and how to create a meal plan and all that stuff i'll leave a couple of videos down below to, if you guys want to check that out but basically when you're in a calorie deficit, especially after a couple months, you start to feel very tired, very fatigued, and doing a lot more exercise and doing more activity is just gonna make you hungrier. And so in my experience, what I've found to work best is again, three low intensity cardio sessions and one sprint style session per week. And so what I like to do is actually walk. So I actually invested in a walking treadmill because I'm in front of my computer like for the majority of the day and I used to be sedentary, but now that I'm walking, doing 10,000 steps, averaging 10,000 steps per day, something like a walking treadmill can be very beneficial. I do have a review on this guy. If you wanna check that out, I'll leave that linked in the description. But walking, why walking? Walking is one of the best forms of cardio that you can do. Why? Because it is very low intensity, low impact, and does not impede your recovery. And if you're someone who lifts heavy weights and does a lot of strength training like me, then doing some low intensity cardio will not in interfere with that. For example, if I was to go do sprints four times a week, but also squat, heavy, do heavy squats and heavy deadlifts twice a week or something, that's going to definitely affect that. So. That is why walking is a great option, a great alternative for somebody who does a lot of strength training or works with weights in general. So I do that about three times per week. Now for how long? You wanna do like about 45 minutes to an hour of low intensity steady state cardio. Now walking isn't the only form. For to get a lot of calories burned with walking, you have to do like multiple hours of walking. So if you wanna do something that, that saves a little bit more time, you can do like low intensity jogging, for example. You can jog like one and a half miles and then walk the rest or however many calories you wanna burn. Let's say you wanna burn 300 calories, you can do a mile and a half, which is about 200-ish calories, and then walk the rest if you wanna do that. Or, or you can jog however many calories you wanna burn, however long that takes a low intensity jog, you can do that as well. So you wanna do something like this three times a week. And so what I do it takes a couple of hours. So if I wanna burn 300 calories while walking, I have to spend two hours. Again, that's why I invested in the under desk treadmill because I can walk and get some work done at the same time. And so walking again is a great form of cardio, especially while cutting, it doesn't interfere with your workouts. That being said, High intensity interval training is also very beneficial for fat loss. That is why I do one 30 minute sprint style session per week as well on top of the walking. This is also great for cardiovascular health and improving your VO2 max. And so I like to do sprints. These do interfere with my recovery and I am aware of that. However, it is not as bad as doing it four times per week versus one times per week. So again, how much cardio should you be doing when trying to lose weight? You should, the majority of your cardio should be low intensity, steady state cardio. This can be walking, jogging at a low intensity. And you're not trying to like run your fastest mile or anything. This is low intensity. So jogging, walking, the Stairmaster, the bike, something like that. Three times per week, maybe even four times per week, 45 minutes to an hour, and then one sprint style session. That is gonna help you burn some extra calories and hopefully aid in your weight loss. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments down below. I'm happy to help and I'll see you guys in the next video.